Our other top story at this hour, a North Idaho man is among the missing after a commercial fishing boat sank in the Gulf of Alaska on Tuesday. The girlfriend of this man, Brock Rainey, says he was one of the seven crew members. Two crew members were rescued, but there's still no sign of the five others, including Rainey, and the Coast Guard suspended the search yesterday due to bad weather. Crime 2's Shayna Waltower is joining us in the studio. Shayna, Rainey has ties to Kellogg, Idaho, correct? Yeah, Mark and Whitney, that is correct. And it's been two days since that boating accident and still no word on these men's location. Yesterday, the Coast Guard had to suspend the search, the search entirely due to rough weather conditions. The Scandies Rose boat's last known location was 170 miles southwest of Air Station Kodiak in Alaska. Crew on the 130-foot crab boat put out a mayday call on the night of New Year's Eve. According to the Coast Guard, stormy weather was putting the ship and its members in danger. Two people on the boat were rescued, but there has been no word from the other five, including Brock Rainey. His girlfriend confirmed that he lived in Kellogg, Idaho during the fishing season. She says they lived together in Indiana and were planning on getting married when he returned in March. The Coast Guard search covered 20 hours and spanned 1,500 square miles. Now, the exact reason on why the ship sank is still currently under investigation. You can keep up with the latest updates on our website at creme.com. In studio, Shana Waltower, Creme 2 News.